what is going on guys welcome back to inside the pit i'm your host josh berg tonight is going to be a long night for me we got new in harvest weight we got new slaves we've got new crystal lake but more importantly we've got a brand new fit for a king single locked in my head i'm really excited for this one looks like it's just a the official band or record uh haven't released any official music video or lyric video or visualize or anything like that but if you go on to, I pre-ordered the path on my streaming service and there it is right there in between breaking the mirror and got a fire the first two singles so um and what I did is I listened to the first one second of this video and on, on my phone to make sure it all matched up and it did so I clicked on this first video and then here we go so Fit for a King, one of my favorite bands. Um, number two on my bucket list to see live right now. Um, but we're gonna, you guys are going to have a ton of content over the next couple of days. We're going to be reacting to this song right here by Fit for a King. I'm going to be doing a album review of Crystal Lake's remastered version of The Voyages. I'm going to be doing an album review of Slave's new album. I'm going to be doing a... Um, album review of In Heart's Wake new album. It's going to be a very busy week this week and next week. Got a lot of cool stuff. But that's enough chit chat. Make sure you guys like the video. Subscribe if you are brand new. Comment down below what you guys want me to react to. And follow me on Twitter at JoshBerg0611. This is Locked in My Head by Fit for a King. Let's go. on the wall, replaying every story, reality got lost in the fear waiting for Is Ryan doing cleans? Like, full cleans? Interesting. I like the drum prominence in the mix. Production's pretty solid. Okay. Reminds me more of Breaking the Mirror than it does Got a Fire. Production in the mix is really nice. I can hear everything is very crisp. Very basic. Definitely more radio friendly. Solo. I can dig the solo. Big open space here. Okay. Okay, that was locked in my head by Fit for a King. Let's dive into the music, shall we? 
Just got off work. It's 1 a.m. where I'm at. So, a little bit exhausted. Um, structure is very basic. Instrumentation is very basic. Vocals are solid, but they're basic. The, this song is a complete contrast to God of Fire, which I kind of expected going in. Um, because you release a big, heavy banger like God of Fire, you've got to, you know, balance the singles out with... You know, a song like this. It reminds me a lot of what Wage War did with Pressure. Some of the songs that they released on Pressure reminded me of this. So, yeah, to say I was disappointed would be an understatement. Um, like I said, production was really good, crisp. You can hear everything. Vocals are really solid, but it's not fit for a king to me. That, sa- that sounded more of like a asking Alexandria. new Like new asking Alexandria. Um, radio rock type stuff, which isn't why I listen to Fit for a King. I listen to Fit for a King for the big heavy breakdowns. Um, and, you know, to be punched in the face and, you know, have these really dirty scream vocals with these big epic clean choruses and then hit, get hit with a couple breakdowns in a mosh pit every once in a while. Uh, this song was very repetitive. Uh, I don't want to say it was like almost. I can't, I can't hate on this band because I love it so much, but this song to me was basic. It was easy, and I know they've t- they've been outspoken about how much they really love this record and how different it is, different feel, um, which is awesome. I'm glad they're doing what they want to do. But as a fan... Oh, my God. Shit. Sorry, y'all. As a fan of their older stuff, Death Grip and now Dark Skies, the past two albums... And then coming into the path, I really liked the first two singles. To have it come up with this, but I think it was a little bit disappointed. Um, but I'm not going to write out the record quite yet. I'm like, there's no way. This is still my number one anticipated album of the year. The path coming out in September. I'm super freaking excited for it. Um, it'll, like I said, for me, for a lot of singles that I've reacted to and then haven't liked, it'll depend on album placement for me. Where if it's in between these two bangers of heavy, you know, breakdowns and scream vocals and mosh pit um, walls of death, then, you know, I'll appreciate the song a little bit more. But as a standalone, it's nothing special. It's just not my thing. Like I said, mad respect to these guys for what they do. I absolutely love this band. Um, But, I mean, this song kind of fell flat for me. It's just, it wasn't anything great. It wasn't bad. I mean, it's still a solid song, but it's just... For my expectations for Fit for a King, they just weren't met. That's just my personal opinion. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Definitely something that I'm going to have to keep an eye on. I might be a lone wolf on this one for not liking the song. I might be a part of the masses. We'll see. Um, but let me know in the comment section down below what your thoughts on this track was. Also, what you guys want to see me react to and review, I'll be happy to do requests if I haven't listened to them already. Go support Fit for a King, though, in the merch down in the description, uh, I linked all their websites and socials and all that stuff. Down in the description, go support bands, guys, during quarantine and COVID. My number one thing, regardless of the song is bad or good, if you enjoy them, go support them. COVID and quarantine has been really bad on a lot of bands for not being able to tour and all that stuff. So make sure you guys go support them. Support me as well. Like the video, subscribe if you are brand new. Um, I do appreciate all the support on my last video, the Gojira, another world reaction review. Really good track, a lot of good positive feedback on that video as well. Really do appreciate it by everyone. And until the next time, I am Josh Berg, and I am signing out. Thank y'all.